Why do the blood vessels in my eyes make them look yellow? Hi again. Today's tutorial is going to show a little more than tell with this look. It's kind of sassy, kind of clowny, kind of tribal, and pretty damn simple. This is day nine of Pigeon Pie Toba, which is new Halloween-y looks every day. So keep watching if you like this and want to see how it was done. If not, check back tomorrow and there might be something more to your taste. Starting off with this sassy hair. It's good for clowns and it's good for sassy clowns. And I'm gonna contour with blue. Then I go over some of that with pink eyeshadow. I'm using all colours from the Urban Decay Spectrum palette and I would like to say that I planned what I was doing but the only thing I planned was that I wanted to wear this wig and where I wanted the line work. I had these colours in mind but I kept flipping between them and shades of blue with orange accents or shades of blue with purple and gold accents. I only chose these colours when I realised my contour was too sharp and too low so I went in with this greeny blue from the Urban Decay Spectrum palette to soften out the contour and fell in love with the green blue purple gradient. I didn't love the nose thing, it made me look sick, so I blended it out. And then I grabbed a jumbo pencil in milk from NYX for the highlights of my face and neck, blending that out with my Mikasa Beauty oval brushes. Then this was looking odd, so I added some white freckles to bring it a little cuter. Then I covered my eyes in that green-blue, my crease in purples from the same palette, and highlighted the inner corner of my eye with milk as a base for House of Beauty's Diamond Girl highlight. And I liked that highlight so much that I put it everywhere. Then I filled in my brows with blues from the palette, cleaned them up with that milk pencil again, and went and did a bunch of line work off camera. These sides aren't symmetrical, but I'm just going to give you a rundown of the method to deal with this kind of line work, and you can choose your own design, or you can just screenshot a picture of this at the intro if you want to copy the line work exactly. My tips are plan first and look at some reference images if you want. I looked at a bunch of face charts from milk1422 on Instagram and then when your brush hits your face try to follow that plan but if your brush does something different it's no big deal. Little mistakes like that can be incorporated right into the work. With these lines, I especially like to vary the thickness of the lines throughout the length of them, kind of like a ribbon, I guess, and try to make them all similar. If most of your lines are smooth, then smooth out the bumpy ones. If most are spirally, then stick to that. And try to balance the sides of your face, even if they aren't symmetrical. Then again, you can have them unbalanced, but would still probably look cool but I like them kind of balanced. I have that kind of weird disease where I need balance on both sides, otherwise I get like tense and itchy. Like if I do lunges with one leg, I have to do the same amount of lunges with the other leg, otherwise I just, I just freak out. Anyway, um, back to the tutorial. I also added some colored line work, but I outlined them in black to merge these with the rest of the design. My lips are also a pretty funky shape. Choose what works for you and what you think is flattering. I personally think purple goatees look very flattering on me, so I went with that. 
and then I went and added a bunch of circles to the design. Personally, I like circles like this best when they are in a gradient of sorts going from big to small. Then I am done! I hope you can use these kind of pointers to make your own colourful, intricate looks. If not, well, thanks for watching anyway. I will see you tomorrow for more Pigeon Pie-tober. Stay classy, peeps. Focus! These close-up shots would be really cool if my teeth weren't bright yellow. I just took it like this. Oh, it was a beautiful close up. Beautiful. Oh, did you? Beautiful close up. Beautiful. No yellow teeth in sight. No.